Bizman Transit adds a new read and ride bus to the streets. KX News reporter Sanji Milburn explains how it encourages reading throughout the community. This seems like an average bus coming in after a day of service, but what lies inside is an opportunity to learn. Bismang Transit Executive Director Roy Rickard came up with an idea six months ago to turn a bus into a little free library. The purpose of, of having the books on the bus is well, to get more people reading. Um, a lot of places will put Wi-Fi on their buses, things like that, and uh, we just feel that more people reading is a good idea. Um, you c it gives you a way to enjoy the ride. And Tracy Gross and her daughter often use public transportation to go to the library. We use the bus in town here. Uh, my daughter uses it sometimes to, um, like when she leaves school, high school, now she's in college, and she'll take it like down to the library or something. Now they can get double the amount of reading in a day. While Tracy and her daughter are on their way to the library, they can start reading early by reading books on this bus. We go to the library a lot um, to do research for a lot of her papers and things for school. You can see just about everything online, but there's nothing like a book, you know, actually holding a book, looking around, um, writing your own information. There are five organizations sponsoring the bus wrap throughout Bismarck and Mandan, and administrators hope to add books on more buses in the future. Reporting in Bismarck, Sanji Milburn, KX News. Bizman Transit is looking for book donations now, so if you want to help out, you can drop books off at the Transit Depot. A good idea. Yeah, great. Maybe for a Pass the time a little too. on the ride, huh? Yeah, still to come, the young professionals that stopped by for a visit today. What they see here will inspire 